Baking Cupcake Crew and if you happen to be new my name is Ray Ray and so glad to have you stop by this video I know that I didn't talk much in the beginning of this video I haven't done a hygiene shopping vlog in so long I kind of forgot how to vlog it but I'm going to get straight into the haul part of this video and show you everything that I got so I got quite a few things and I'm gonna start off with body wash first so I am a Dove body wash girl I have not used any other body wash in a couple of months like I'm really hooked on Dove body washes they are just so nice they give off a great smell great bubbles and suds it lathers up really well and this one I bought two and this one is the revitalizing it says a new it is blue fig and orange blossom it says restores and replenishes skin and it looks like so and I absolutely love the smell of this It gives me like a good rainfall, but with a sweet smell to it. I was, it's kind of hard to explain. Like I definitely smell the orange blossom in it, but it just reminds me of like a good rain waterfall sweet smell. I absolutely like this and I cannot wait to try it. And then the second body wash that I got, this one is Pampering. It's Shea Butter and Warm Vanilla. And I've had this before and I absolutely love this. And it smells just like it says. It's shea butter and warm vanilla. And it looks like so. But I have been addicted to Dove body washes. I have not used anything else here lately. But I will take that back. Because I forgot I have been using my um, Caress Shea Butter. Shea Butter and Coconut. Shea Butter and Brown Sugar. Oh my god. I can't believe I can't remember what the name of it is called. But I have a whole shower routine using that Caress body wash. So I will put that on the screen down in the description box. And you should definitely check out that video. So I do use a feminine wash down there for the kitty area. I don't like anything that has like a smell. I just want it to be clean. I'm not really caring if it smells like grape or cherry blossom. I just want to make sure everything down there is nice and clean. But I did pick up this. I usually get the Equate Feminine Wash. Um, you know, the one that you can find at Walmart. But I picked up this one. This one is Vagisil Odor Block Daily Intimate Wash. And it says it doesn't have a smell. But it's triple odor protection, gentle on skin, tough on odor, odor dye-free, and hypoallergenic. So I got this Vagisil Feminine Wash. Okay, so let's move into lotion. 
I have been a very, 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 very big fan of In Shower Lotion. Um, the one that I like to use is this. This is the Nivea In Shower Body Lotion. This is almond oil smelling, or it has almond oil in it, I should say. And it's for very dry skin. It looks like so. I can't get enough of using In Shower Body Lotions. Really, it's just a great way to add another layer of moisture to yourself. But sometimes, I'm not going to lie, I'm very lazy. And I really don't want to like lotion myself once I get out the shower or the bath. So this is perfect for my girls or even my fellas out there. You know, some of y'all is not getting out the shower and lotioning yourselves. I just know y'all not. So you can go ahead and put on your lotion while you're in the shower already. I know that this is the Nivea brand, but I know that Olay has, um, I think it's body moisturizer or body conditioner. It's the same thing. It's in shower lotion. You apply it to your wet skin, you know, rinse off, and then you're, boom, you're done. So days that I don't feel lazy and I do add, like, more moisture to my body and actually want to hydrate my skin, I have been using and loving Dove's Cream Oil Body Lotion. And this is the one that I bought. Looks like so. And it just says, Cream Oil Everyday Care Body Lotion for All Skin Types. Hydrates and absorbs quickly for soft and instantly refreshed skin. I know that there is like three... Oh, excuse me. I know that there's like three other different types of cream oil body lotions. But this is the one that I've been using. It just has like this dark blue heart on the bottle but yeah i have been so in love with the cream oil body lotions and if you happen to not know what a cream oil body lotion is it's um basically it has the oil already into the lotion so some people like to use the palmers um oh my god i can't think of the name of it some people like to use like the Palmer's oil and mix it with the lotion, but you don't have to do that with this type of lotion. It's already in there for you, so I absolutely love that. So I picked up some deodorant, and of course it's by the Dove brand. I have really just been all about the products here lately, and this is my favorite one. This is the Indulging Ritual Dry Spray, and it's vanilla and cocoa butter. And this is also featured in my shower routine video, so definitely check that out because it was all like brown sugar and cocoa butter products. So yeah, definitely check that video out. But I absolutely love this dry spray. I have not used a deodorant stick all year. Like all year, all 2021, I was using dry spray. And it helps with hyperpigmentation, which is like the coloring of your underarms. So it helps. It has been working for me. It has been lightening up those areas. And it definitely protects you from odor. So I would highly suggest to use the Dove dry sprays. But if you're not feeling the Dove brand, which that would really surprise me. <laughs> if someone doesn't like Dove, use any type of dry spray. It really helps with the coloring of your underarms. And moving on to like facial products. I picked up the Neutrogena Oil Free Acne Wash Daily Scrub um face wash and it looks like so and please excuse my nails they're like horrendous but um i've been using this for so long and i can actually tell that it is helping my face my skin on my face is so weird i definitely have combination skin where it will feel dry but it it looks like I'm sweating like oil is producing all over my face so I'm definitely combo and this is helping I really wish that my skin was not did not appear so oily like this t-zone area I know y'all see it it's it's shining baby it's shining and I'm not hot I am not sweating it's just oil and the t-zone area is just crazy so again like, if somebody knows something that can help me with my T-zone area and all this oil, comment below. Help your girl out. I've been fighting this for so long. But I do like using this. I like to use anything that's oil-free for my face. Alright, and as far as, like, facial pads go, I've been using this. This is Oxy Acne Medication 3-in-1 Acne Pads. It says maximum strength. It unclogs pores, controls oil, and helps smooth marks. So... It looks like so. 
and I go I, I go for these or I gravitate towards these on days where I just really don't want to wash my face before going to bed so I will you know just take off any makeup that I have and I will wipe my face with one of these oxy pads and I will call it a night so I did pick up some razors and my favorite razors I like to use are the Soleil Big Soleil Glide looks like this and it has five blades on it which I love the five blades um never using three blades again but um while I was looking for this I picked up if you saw in the beginning of the video I picked up a intuition um razor and it looks super intriguing like all you have to do is like add water um shave and then like you're done but that was ten dollars for the razors the only reason why I didn't get it is because the refillable blades the little blade heads were like twenty dollars for a cartridge and me at that moment I wasn't trying to pay that but I really do want to try that so if anyone has used those intuition razors please comment below if that is worth it the high price of those cartridges to you know replace the blades and whatnot like somebody please let me know comment comment below okay so the next item that I picked up, this is definitely, 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 definitely something I have been using a lot of. And this is the Vaseline Original Healing Jelly. It looks like this. It's just a small jar of Vaseline. And it has been doing wonders for my hands, you guys. In the winter, I am so dry. Like, my hands will, well, I can actually show you if it will focus like do y'all see all that dryness like right here like my hands are so terrible in the winter time and i love using this vaseline jelly and even the like instructions if you like ever read those so the use of this is temporarily protects and helps relieve chapped or cracked skin and lips and baby in the winter time i i got dry and cracked hands okay so i like using this it's pocket size i can put this in my pocket and pull it out whenever i just look down at my hand and notice that it's looking like alligator skin okay so i have one more item before i get into like oral health care but this is my go-to so even though i don't do this daily like i used to because i've really been slacking but on a daily when i get out of the shower i like to go ahead and file my feet and my heels i want soft and you know scale free heels and feet so i like to use this this is the shapey file holy file and it removes dead skin and smooths the feet and it looks like so and i love it it has a curved part right here so you know you can curve it and get it underneath your heel and it says that it is coarse and i'm all about like I'm all for that like if it hurts and it's, I'm seeing a lot of skin falling off I feel like it's working you know but this is definitely a coarse um, foot foul but me personally I like that okay so the next two things that I'm going to show you guys is definitely for oral health care me I have been using um, charcoal mouth care products <laughs> i've been using a charcoal um, toothbrush charcoal toothpaste and i've been using charcoal mouthwash and this is the one that i've been using it is by a brand called hello it's activated charcoal extra freshening mouthwash it's a natural fresh mint with coconut oil it has no alcohol moisturizes the mouth and is epic freshening and yeah I really like this. Um, I really just got this mouthwash because I was just trying to keep it in a like, charcoal mouth care family or whatnot. Um, but this does really taste good and it doesn't give you like that aftertaste. You know how some mouthwashes just be lingering around in your mouth and it ain't that pleasant. This one, I don't have no complaints about it. It tastes pretty well. It doesn't make my mouth feel funny or whatnot and I really like using this mouthwash. And another thing that I have incorporated in my oral health care is a tongue scraper. Like, I did not, like, I've heard people say, like, brush your tongue, brush your tongue, you know, like, 
growing up, you ain't really brushing your tongue. But it helps so much with the funkiness that is inside of your mouth. Like, it really does. If you take off whatever is on your tongue, I swear, your breath will smell at least two times better than if you would have just left it on. So, I use a tongue scraper, and this is Aura Brush by Dentec. And it looks like so. And this one is pink. The one I'm using now is orange. But yeah, it says 90% of bad breath comes from a dirty tongue. Clean yours. It's on the package, so I mean, clean your tongue. Alright you guys, that was everything that I bought while I was hygiene shopping. Um, I didn't get a whole lot of things, but what I did get, I hope that you got some tips from. And, you know, you would try out some of these products. But again, do comment if any if you know of any product that can help me with my oily t-zone area that i got going on and also what else did i want to know about oh do let me know about that um intuition razor because i am really really intrigued by it but i mean i just really can't see me spending that money on buying cartridges but Thank you for watching this video. If you have made it to this point, you are such a trooper. And if you are not a part of the Cupcake Crew, it doesn't take much. All you have to do is subscribe and be a part of the bakery. And you can see my face. Um, <laughs> Lost my train of thought. <laughs> but yeah, all you have to do is subscribe and you will see my face one time a week. I post on every Saturday. And yeah, thank you for watching this video. And I will catch you guys in another one. You know, this is Chef Ray Ray signing out. Love you guys. Bye.